guys welcome and welcome back so before i start i do want to say happy new year's to everybody may god continue to bless each and every one of us with a lot of blessings happiness health and wealth and without further ado i am doing a review of still new to me i did not even know about these they are by ColourPop. i have three lipstick and these are the Lux velvet and i have fata i got engineer and then i have la Berge. So I was on Ulta website and I saw these, they're on sale and I was like, I mean, let me just go ahead and get them um, because I have not purchased a lot of stuff from ColourPop lately. They just have so much stuff that like, I just get, it's, it's, it's just a lot, it's a lot. But I saw these and I was like, let me just go ahead and get them. I did also get some of the lip glosses. Um, I will do a separate video of those, but since I only got three of these, I was like, let me just go ahead and do a lip swatch. So. Let me see. I do have one of them on now, and I don't remember which one it is. Yeah, I have this one on, which is um, Engineu. I have this one, and I'm going to swatch them for you guys. Again, these are not new, but they're new to me. So, yeah. So, you could see it on my lips, but let me just swatch it just in case. You're lighter than me. This is how it looks. It's like a pinkish type of color. This one is for tall. It's a very pretty pinkish color and then let's do it right here oh that's pretty and then the last shade I got is La Berge and I'm pretty sure on Colourpop website there's more shades but these are the only one Alta had oh this one's beautiful they're all pretty and again as I mentioned I do have the shade engine you on right now and i don't know i don't know if you guys could see but it's doing this thing right here which i don't like i hate when lip glosses lipstick do that but yeah so i'm gonna take this off and i'm gonna just try all of them again just so you guys could see if you are interested and again this is um, um on my hand this is for ta this is engine you and this is la Berge. I'm butchering those names, but yeah, so I'm gonna take this off and then I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back and I do want to say these are a very soft matte type of lipstick. I love how this feels on like it wasn't drying. I do have other ColourPop lipsticks when I used to purchase from them and those they do like crack your lips and I believe that was like when they were first coming out really and you would have to like really <laughs> take care of your lips before applying their products because they're very drying. Again, I have not purchased a lot from ColourPop lately because they have so much products but when I applied this on earlier I was surprised like it was very soft like not drying at all my lips felt like I had nothing on so I do like that and um, I might get more um, because I actually really like how this feels on so I'm gonna apply the same one I had on again I just wanted to take it off so you guys could see like a fresh layer and again this one is engine you I am gonna apply it by itself and then with the um, with the lip liner Okay, so this is Engine U by itself without a lip liner. Again, as I mentioned, these lipsticks are very soft, very creamy. It is definitely a soft matte formula. I am going to go ahead and go with my ColourPop BFF3 lip liner. Okay, and this is it with the ColourPop BFF3 lip liner. It looks really nice on, and it's now just starting to settle down and dry. But again, these are not drying, they're very soft. Just very, very pretty. And I do love how this look with the lip liner on. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off, and then I'm gonna try the other two on. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead with La Berge, and I'm gonna apply the more pinkish shade last. I don't think I'm gonna need a lip liner with this one. So this is how La Berge is looking like. And I don't think I really need a lip liner with it, but I mean, I wouldn't mind wearing a lip liner with it, but I feel like I could get away with just it by itself. 
it looks really really nice i am gonna apply a lip liner just in case you want to see it with the lip liner so all of them i'm just gonna apply the same lip liner okay so this is la Berge with the ColourPop bff3 lip liner and it is so pretty like i could wear it without a lip liner of course but with the lip liner like this is so pretty okay so fatal is the more pinkish shade so let's see how this looks on this is how fatal is looking like and of course i don't really need a lip liner with this one because it is a darker shade but I will still apply one just to see the difference in color. But this is how it's looking like without a lip liner. This is how Fatal is looking like with the lip liner. I definitely see a difference between it without the lip liner and it with the lip liner. It is still pretty without it, but I do, you know, prefer a lot of my lipstick, lip glosses with lip liners. So yeah, so I do love the packaging. I love this flower and everything they got going on. Um, I was expecting for the top to be the same, but it's fine. Now I do want to say like, I didn't know about these. I don't know if, you know, other people knew about them and just didn't say anything. I I knew about the lip glosses that they have of like the same packaging but I did not know about these so I'm glad that I was on Ulta just browsing and then I saw these so yeah I'm glad that I was able to pick these three these are the only one I saw um, I'm pretty sure on the Colourpop website they have more shades but I am very satisfied with these three so yeah let me know if you have these let me know what you think about them I really do like them if you see these on Ulta pick them up right now they are on sale so you're not really losing anything in my opinion so this is how it's looking like as it dries down of course it doesn't really go with the makeup i have on with my eyes and then this orange blush but it is so pretty and as you can see as it dries like look how it looks on my lips it's like i have nothing on but you could still see it like i don't know if i'm explaining it correctly but i love lip products like these i love lip products that dries down like this like a powder type of finish so yeah i'm really happy that i was able to find these on ulta and i'm pretty sure on colourpop website there's plenty more shades but i do like these shades and yeah so let me know if you already have these let me know what you think about them let me know if you're gonna go and purchase them as i mentioned earlier these are on sale currently on ulta as well so yeah but that's all i have for today you guys thank you so much for coming back to my channel and watching another one of my videos i definitely appreciate it Bye.